Love Actually, 20th Anniversary, Kira Knightley, Hugh Grant and Colin Firth Then and Now. Love Actually also starred Emma Thompson, Alan Rickman and Liam Neeson, among others. Love Actually is 20. The classic romantic comedy follows nine love stories, including tales about a woman whose husband is cheating on her, a man who's in love with his best friend's wife, and a little boy trying to profess his love to his crush. In its initial run, the movie made nearly $250 million at the global box office, and has since become a must-watch movie during the holiday season. Here is what the film's cast has been up to since its November 2003 release date. Hugh Grant was the director's first choice to play the Prime Minister in Love Actually. Prior to accepting the role, Grant had been nominated for three Golden Globe Awards for Four Weddings and a Funeral, which he won for Notting Hill and About a Boy, going on to earn three more nominations. He was also well known for his roles in Sense and Sensibility, Nine Months, and Bridget Jones's Diary. He continued starring in successful films, including Bridget Jones, The Edge of Reason, Music and Lyrics, Did You Hear About the Morgans, Cloud Atlas, The Man from UNCLE, and Florence Foster Jenkins. Later, he starred in Paddington 2, A Very English Scandal, The Undoing, the latter two earning him both Golden Globe and Emmy Award nominations, Glass Onion and Dungeons and Dragons, Honor Among Thieves. He will star as an Oompa Loompa in the upcoming Willy Wonka origin film, Wonka, set to premiere in December 2023. Grant married Anna Eberstein in 2018. They have four children, John, Felix and their two daughters. Grant also has a daughter, Tabitha, with his ex-girlfriend Ting Lan Hong. Emma Thompson already had two Academy Awards, three BAFTAs, an Emmy and two Golden Globes, and many other nominations before taking on the role of Karen in Love Actually. She was best known for her roles in Howard's End, Sense and Sensibility, Wit, The Remains of the Day, and In the Name of the Father. She continued starring in popular movies, including Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban, and two of its sequels, Nanny McPhee, and its sequel, Stranger Than Fiction, and Education, Men in Black 3, Brave, The Love Punch, and Saving Mr. Banks, which earned her BAFTA, Golden Globe and SAG Award nominations. Later, she starred in A Walk in the Woods, Burnt, Bridget Jones's Baby, and Beauty and the Beast. The actress then starred in Johnny English Strikes Again, Late Night, Men in Black, International, Last Christmas, Doolittle, and Cruella. Most recently, Thompson starred in Good Luck to You, Leo Grande, What's Love Got to Do With It, and Roald Dahl's Matilda the Musical, in which she played Ms. Trunchbull. Thompson was married to Kenneth Branagh from 1989 to 1995. She then married Greg Wise in 2003, and they have two children Gaia and Tindyebwa, who they adopted in 2003 from Rwanda. Colin Firth was known for his roles in Tumbledown, Pride and Prejudice, Bridget Jones's Diary, The English Patient and Shakespeare in Love before taking the role of Jamie in Love Actually. Throughout his career, he's received two Academy Award nominations, winning one, five BAFTA nominations, winning two, two Emmy nominations, three Golden Globe nominations, winning one, and five SAG Awards, winning three. He went on to star in the two Bridget Jones sequels, Nanny McPhee, The Last Legion, Mamma Mia, returning for the 2018 sequel, A Summer in Genoa, A Single Man, A Christmas Carol, and The King's Speech. He then starred in Magic in the Moonlight, Kingsman, The Secret Service, and its sequel, Mary Poppins Returns, 1917, and The Secret Garden. Most recently, he has starred in Operation Mincemeat, The Staircase, and Empire of Light. Firth was in a relationship with Meg Tilly from 1989 to 1994, and they had one son, William. He then was married to Livia Giugioli from 1997 to 2019, and together they have two sons, Luca and Matteo. Prior to starring as Daniel in Love Actually, Liam Neeson was known for his roles in Schindler's List, Michael Collins, Under Suspicion, and Star Wars, Episode I, The Phantom Menace. He continued his streak of starring in successful movies, appearing in Kinsey, Batman Begins, The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, The Witch and the Wardrobe, and its sequels, and Taken, and its sequels. Later, the actor starred in Ponyo, Five Minutes of Heaven, Clash of the Titans, The Next Three Days, Unknown, and The Grey. 
Neeson starred in many action movies, such as Wrath of the Titans, Battleship, The Dark Knight Rises, as well as comedies and science fiction movies like The Lego Movie, Star Wars, The Clone Wars, and A Million Ways to Die in the West.